Look at that sky. I'm Corey. I'm Jillian. And we're living in Diz. Today we have no special plans for the park. We're just going to have some fun here on Labor Day weekend. A lot of rides are closed right now. They will open later. We will try the Cheshire Cattail today if it is open. Um, other than that, just come along, sit back, grab your popcorn and have some fun. Grab your licorice too. Let's go! I gotta have everything I can to keep my wife from stealing one of those on the way out every Halloween. got an early tip or trick. Um, I love to talk about management with you guys. So our plan was to go on Splash Mountain. Can't go on Splash Mountain because of the weather. Um, the weather's going to clear up later, so we could use it for Splash Mountain later. Um, but what we're going to do is we're going to take that Fast Pass because it is now converted. When you look at your Fast Pass on your um, My Experience app, um, which I go through so you can see it there I'll put a link for you You can see my tutorial on how to be a, an expert in 10 minutes with the mobile app so I looked at the mobile app and it changed to multiple experiences from Splash Mountain which means we can use it on anything here uh, some parks there are restrictions but here we can use it for anything and what I'm interested in is Space Mountain so basically we're taking our Splash Mountain that's been changed and we are going to um, Space Mountain because it's indoors and when we get out we're hopeful that the storm will pass over and we can resume our normal day. This is very different and unexpected. We have some walls up here at Monster's Laugh Floor. Unexpected. It is still open but there are walls up. I'm going to find out why. So I have the scoop. This big section here is coming down. You heard it here first on Living in Diz. This big section is coming down in front of Laugh Floor. Wow. Behind me is here on Test Track where... Oh, wait, no, 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 sorry. Behind me here is the display board for Space Mountain, which is where you can get off the ride and scan your magic band on the little Mickey, and you'll instantly get the photo pass if you have photo pass, you'll instantly get that photo sent to you on the app. Um, what I learned recently is you don't actually have to do that. It will show up eventually on your app anyway. But we still like to scan just to just to be sure. We are here at the Cheshire Cafe to try none other than the Cheshire Cat Tail. We've been looking for this for a while. Here we are, right in front of the Mad Tea Party attraction with the Cheshire Cat Tail. Let's give it a try. Go ahead. So I'm going to give it a try. What does it taste like? Looks like chocolate. Mm-hmm. It kind of reminds me of like a croissant type thing. And it's, uh, it has chocolate inside. It, it, it looks... This part looks like a croissant and it has um, like little stripes of frosting. Little man's gonna give it a try. Tear it up. It's pretty good. Pretty good? What do you taste? What's that darker stuff in there? Is that chocolate or is it a berry? I think it's chocolate. Chocolate? What a nice mix of stuff. It not only reminds me of a croissant, but like, sort of like um, the Napoleon, because I mean, it's the texture and layers. And you can see our review of the Napoleon up top in the link right there, where um, we went to Hollywood Studios at Starbucks and gave that a try. Mm -hmm. Pretty similar in texture, right? Mm -hmm. So the kids said it all with that review. We'll stick with that. Um, and I just, I'll agree with everything they said. 
Um, it's served warm. There's a nice mix of chocolate with some um, drizzle with decorative colors that match the sign behind me um, and the Cheshire Cat, of course, really. So it was awesome. Cheshire Cat, $4.99 at the Cheshire Cafe. Check that out whenever you're kind of in between Tomorrowland and Fantasyland. Right here. There goes T.I. Double Gut. Er, and <laughs> Winnie the Pooh. I've got a rumbly in my tumbly. Our favorite place to eat in all of Magic Kingdom when bringing our own lunch or dinner is on the balcony of Pinocchio House, H-A-U-S. We get this kind of view in the middle of um, the park and we select one of those chairs and tables that's usually open and we get a beautiful view sitting from up there. Jillian discovered that one day and, uh, and we tried it. So lots of fun up there, nice little private balcony spot for a sandwich or whatever. And then we move on. So we came out winners on our little calculated gamble uh, where we did take up Space Mountain. We never saw any rain. After we boarded that, we got out and the, the sky started to clear. The skies are looking much better. And we have not had to pull our ponchos out. Our second fast pass also changed to a multiple. And when again, when that happens, it means you have the choice of any ride. Um, at that point. So at that point we split off and the girls took Big Thunder Mountain Railroad and um, actually Jacob and mom took Big Thunder Mountain Railroad and Jillian and I took Splash Mountain. So kind of neat in that in that instance where you get to um, change your mind or it allows you to kind of manipulate things with the weather. So we've been dry, haven't had to pull the ponchos out, we're having a great day. Did you know that you can adopt a child or an animal here at Disney World? Yes, it's true. On Small World, you just pick a child, pick an animal, and you have visitation to see them whenever you come on the ride. See? All these Japanese... That's my kid right there. Excuse me, those That's are my, my kid children. right there. That's, that's Michelle. Excuse me, those are no, my I'm your kid. See, there's my adopted daughter, and she blinks. She blinks. She blinks. See, I'm gonna give like that pig some love today. You know, when's the last time he had some love? I mean, people just pass by here and pay attention to all the big moving stuff. Let's give love to that pig today. This is the best area of Small World. If you agree or disagree, comment below and let us know. It's so peaceful and relaxing. Hawaii. The only part of the ride with no singing. Jill. Yes. Jill. Yes. Hey, Jill. Yes. Guess what's better than being in the happiest place on Earth? I don't think I can think of anything. How about going on the happiest ride on Earth? The Little Mermaid ride. Little Mermaid is the happiest, hands down, ride at Magic Kingdom. You know what I'm gonna say. Let's go! We're about to go under the sea. We are under the sea already. Poor Ariel, she just can't seem to get out of that cyclone. The fireworks have started. This is when you go to Mine Train. 20 to 30 minute wait max. You don't have to worry about getting that fast pass. Let's go. Here's something that's new and fully operational now at the Mine Train. Certain diamonds here, while you're in the queue, when you touch them, they light up even brighter. Jacob's gonna try one. How about that one right there, Brett? There we go. Or maybe they just randomly light up. For joining us today for a magical gathering of family, friends,
And that's going to conclude our video here today at the Magic Kingdom. We enjoyed a Cheshire Cat Tale, which was highly recommended by Disney Food Blog. That's another great blog. You should check that out. Um, Go subscribe to her. Awesome. We would try it again anytime. Located near the Mad Tea Party and easily located in a little, little uh, kiosk. Um, we also hit Little Mermaid. Um, had a lot of fun with that and a lot of other things on a low-key Labor Day weekend. Overall, just a very chill video. Till next time, I'm Corey. I'm Jillian. And we're Living, Living in Biz. In Biz.